Now watch. Jesus said, watch how he stated it. The works that I do, he's doing them right now. The works that I'm doing now, healing the sick, raising the dead, opening the eyes of the blind, these works shall you do also. You'll do these if you believe in me. You do these works. And then a greater than this shall you do. For I go to my Father. A little while and the world won't see me no more. Yet you'll see me. I'll be with you, even in you, to the end of the world. I will not leave you comfortless. I'll pray the Father. He'll send you another comforter, which is the Holy Ghost. Whom the world cannot receive, yet you can receive him. Now notice, the greater works was to have the power in the church, not only to heal the sick by prayer, cast out devils by prayer, but to impart eternal lives to believers. The Holy Ghost was coming and given into the hands of the church to impart life. Oh, praise his name. Oh. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. That's what Calvary meant. Yes. It touched stoop, degraded men and women and lifted them into a place to be sons and daughters of God, to heal the sick, and to impart eternal life by giving the Holy Ghost to obedient believers. Man who were once the unbelievers be made believers and impart spiritual eternal life.